first of all, I'm really, really happy to, to be part of the team. The team has great history, great heritage, and um, everybody's extremely motivated. It's great to be part of that motivation because, uh, of course, I'm, uh, I have the same spirit. I really want to develop, and I hope that this year will be a, a year where I can uh, demonstrate what I can do, not only to to the team, but also to myself. If I can be scoring points, if the car is a, score, is a point scorer, I want to be every time at 100% of what the car can do. After a few races with the Renault engine, uh, I've learned a great deal about it. It's a, it's a very good unit, it has very good drivability, and I'm sure this is going to be a big improvement for, for the team because uh, uh, as a driver, you need to have every weapon you have in your hand to make sure that your stint is good. So uh, I'm sure that we can develop the car even better with the Renault engine and uh, it should be interesting to give them some feedback compared to uh, the, my previous experience with the engine. Well, Pastor is a, is a great driver. I've raced against him in GP2 and uh, for two years and we, you know, we always get along well. He's been a, a very tough uh, opponent in the past. and. Uh, it's going to be even tougher now in the same car, so for sure we're going to be trying to beat each other. But uh, you know, as teammates, we're going to collaborate with each other and bring the team forward. Today we've been uh, doing some simulator work. Uh, it's been very useful for me to learn uh, the steering wheel layout and uh, how the team works. I've been working with my engineers, uh, which helps a lot. And uh, you just uh, take all those procedural uh, things away from you when, before you get into the real car. So when you get into the actual car, you don't have to think about that. You just drive the car and then try to work as, uh, as um, seamlessly as possible. Fuel loads, 40 kilos at the moment. Okay, copy. The more developed the simulator can be, the better, because then you can really um, do a race simulation before the race weekend, and you arrive on Friday with a much better understanding of the car and of the track and that all can make a big difference for you during the race weekend. The relationship between an engineer and a driver is something that uh, few people can understand. You need to really be gelling very well with your engineer. You need to understand each other very well and all that can uh, make the difference on your results for the end of the year. When you're in Formula 1 you're always enjoying and learning so last year was a very, um, a very strange different year. But it was great in a way because it put me in a position to be to be here now. The Renault was a good car last year, um, but on several, on several occasions I think he got the better of his more experienced teammates. And he didn't make mistakes that were damaging to progress, forward progress. I thought Jeremy did very, very well considering he was thrown in at the deep end towards the end of the season. I guess this will be my most exciting year so far and hopefully it will be my best year. And, uh, Every year after this will be even better. Well, it's amazing to be part of the team with such heritage. Uh, we're here in the museum now and uh, I just come here and I start drooling because uh, all these cars, I've seen them racing and uh, you always think with yourself, how, how could it been racing those cars and uh, I've seen them on the track but never been inside them so I hope I can be driving the active car in Goodwood just to have a feel but you know in fairness it's uh, it's just great and uh, I hope that we can be uh, part of this history and uh, write a good a good chapter to be in Formula One was always my dream of course I was uh, since a very young age a fan of motor racing of course there's great influence from my uncle in this but ever since I put my my feet on the go-kart. I never wanted to do anything else. Well, there's a romantic side of one's mind says, I wonder if he's as good as his uncle. It's going to be fantastic if he is. But um, I'd just like to see him be, be a surprise for everybody. Be nice, it'd be a nice story. Quite a few of the, pe the people here actually worked with Ayrton. There are so many people that stayed in motor racing for so long. And uh, these guys have seen what world champions can do. So um, it's very encouraging for me that they're giving me the chance to prove myself here. And, um, you know, I'm sure that uh, we can uh, bring back some good memories, but hopefully create some new good memories too.